and today we are going to discuss about the electric traffic counter kit and its order code is 52098 and in this video we are going to discuss about the procedure connections and working so this is the electric traffic counter kit it is basically used for efficient monitoring and managing the highway traffic at toll plaza it keeps the track number of vehicles existing and entering at toll plaza both upon arrival and after toll period. So it is basically a traffic detector which making it super handy for toll collection and managing highway traffic. So without wasting time, now I am going to tell you about the connections and the working. So this is the electronic traffic counter. As I said before, it keeps the track number of vehicles existing or entering the toll plaza. So here we have three basic components. Arduino Uno, 7 segment display module, IR sensor module. These two modules are controlled by the Arduino. So this is the brain of the operation. To power it up, you can simply connect it with a 5 volt adapter. So I am connecting the 5 volt adapter to powering it up. So here you can see that once powered, a red LED will glow up, which signals that it has started. So now I am connecting one by one both the modules with the Arduino. So firstly this is the IR sensor which is basically responsible for detecting the vehicles which passes in the front of this IR sensor. So here we have two connections. Ground is internally connected. So two connections are there. First is giving power supply to it and second is data pin. So by connecting the Arduino by giving the 5 volt supply to this IR sensor. So by using patch port, I am connecting the plus 3 volt to the Arduino Uno 5 volt. It is responsible for giving the power supply to the IR sensor. Now I am connecting this data pin to the Arduino D3 pin. It is responsible for giving the data from IR sensor to the Arduino Uno. After detecting the vehicles to IR sensor, it gives the data from IR sensor to the Arduino Uno. So now all the connections of the IR sensor are done. Now moving on the third component, 7 segment display. So here we have 4 connections. First is ground, second is VCC power supply, third is SCL clock pin and fourth is SDA data pin. So one by one we connect all these connections with the Arduino. So firstly I am connecting the ground of the 7 segment display with the ground of the Arduino. So I am connecting it ground of the 7 segment display with the ground of the Arduino Uno. Now similarly we have to give power supply to the 7 segment display also. That's why we are using uh, the 3 P3 of this Arduino for giving the power supply to the 7 segment display. So it is responsible for giving the power supply to the 7 segment display. Now I am connecting the clock pin of the uh, 7 segment display to the D3 of the Arduino pin. Similarly, I am connecting the SDA pin, data pin to the D2 of the Arduino Uno. So these all connections are clearly mentioned in our manual which is given to you along with this kit. Here you can see that all these connections are described clearly in this manual. So you can take reference of this manual and perform the experiment easily. So here all the connections of the 7 segment display and the IR sensors are done. They are connected completely with this Arduino. Now I am showing the working of this kit. So we have done all these connections of electronic traffic counter. Now we will see the working of this electronic traffic counter. So here you can see that a track is shown to here which indicates that when any vehicle is passes from this track then the sensor detects the vehicle and its signals value becomes low. And when there is no vehicle in the front of this IR sensor, then its signal's value becomes high. So when any vehicle passes from this track and comes in the range of this IR sensor, then it detects the object 
and its signals value becomes low that low value gives given to the microcontroller arduino uno then it further processed and updated a signal and this updated signal can be displayed on this seven segment display module so this is the basic procedure behind the working of this electronic traffic counter firstly when any vehicle comes in the range of this ir sensor it detects the vehicle and its signals value becomes low then this low value is given to this microcontroller it further process on that and update a signal and sends the command to the seven segment display to be shown the updated value so i am showing here uh, there suppose it is an object when i move it from this ir sensor it counts to and when i move it again from this ir sensor in the front of this ir sensor then it's count 4 so as i move it again its count become increasing so as you can see that so that is how these all components are working together so that is how all these components are working together these two modules are controlled by the arduino you know which based on the program which we already installed in it and all these connection procedure working are clearly mentioned in our manual also so you can take the reference of the manual for more information so this is the working of electronic traffic counter so that's all the demonstration from my side if you have any query related to this case you can contact at tesca global website and you can find the link in the description box for more information you can go to the manual also thank you for watching this video if you like it like share and subscribe thank you